Being a flower seller doesn't win your customers in the long term. In order to succeed, you need to stop selling and start building. Now there are a number of ways to do this, but I like to do it by adding value. The way you add value is by giving your potential customers something for nothing. And I never mean discounting your product or service, I mean giving them something extra. For example, Gabby, our dietitian, she provides great tasting, low calorie recipes to her potential customers. And Melanie, our interior designer, writes insightful articles on decor trends. Business owners often ask me how they can build value to potential customers that they've never met. Now I know it's difficult, but I have to admit with social media, it makes it much easier. First, you find your target audience online. They're definitely there somewhere. You might have to dig a little deeper. And then you start talking to them by stroking their ego and you like and share their posts. Because in the world of social media, we measure our value by the size of our audience. Then you participate in groups where your audience is. You're not selling here, you're just participating. And finally, you set up a blog where you write insightful articles about the industry you work in. Providing value works in every single industry. So feel free to stroke my ego by liking and sharing my videos and don't forget to leave a comment so that I can send you my free starter kit. Thanks for watching.